green here and green here. Okay. You have a lot of green. You. No, you can't pinch me. <laughs> what? You can't. <laughs> I have a lot of green. No, if you got green on, I can't pinch you. Yeah. <laughs> I, I watched the video where you said that the camera. Oh, it's a long way to the W. Me just fine. Okay. Oh, no, I was so cute. I just, I couldn't find the. It's so hard. It's so hard. It's such a beautiful yeah. sign. On my way home. Oh, Out in the island rain. things around Scottish Irish what the fuck it's actually called Highland Rain but with like Ireland Lane sounds good that is some really excellent coffee so here we are here hello Brian hello sir oh my god even Brian's Irish today with a name like that, can't avoid it, mate. Sorry. Your parents weren't thinking ahead. Uh oh, I forgot my cable. Hold on a second. <laughs> 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 What a beautiful night, huh? It's a good thing around here. When springtime comes, clears out some of the uh, the bad air. Uh oh, we got the uh, show light. Well, you know, we've been keeping this. Uh, celebration of the Irish culture going all through COVID. So I figured I might as well keep it going even though we're pretty much over that business. For most of us at least. So uh, here we are. We're doing our thing. And we'll do it as long as we can tonight. We'll just have a bit of fun. There's a few friends that are going to pop by. This isn't, if you're familiar with music box shows, this isn't like a normal music box show. It's just me fucking around and playing a few songs. So find a drink somewhere maybe some smoke Treat you decent, and I'll tell you, I'm an Irish man. Well, I travelled east, I've travelled west, and rode from town to town. I've cut the harvest down and clear with people over and down. Wherever I went, the welcome mat was always waiting me. So fill your glass along with us, and all of Ireland free. Come in, I'm in, I'll do the 
stakan Kom in, kom in, bring your home to the clan Take it slow and easy, I'll shake you by the hand Sit you down and I'll treat you decent till you're an Irish man When I have gone some other place, my memory's growing dim So fill your glass along with us, invite the callers in And then go about the good old times and you'll remember me When good old songs were roaring out and porters flowing free Ah, oh, come in, come in, I'll do the best I can Come in, come in, bring your whole bloody clan Dick it slow and easy, I'll shake you by the hand Sit you down and I'll treat you decent in your an Irish man Come in, come in, I'll do the best I can Come in, come in, bring your old bloody clan Take it slow and easy, I'll shake you by the hand Sit you down and I'll treat you decent in your an Irish man Sit you down and I'll treat you decent till you an Irish man Sit you down and I'll treat you decent Maybe And I'll tell you an Irish Irish people are out here. We're Irish, we're all Irish today, right? That's good you? enough. For real? Most people are Irish and they don't even know it. That's the funny thing is that I'm not. <laughs> no, you know, we're all Scottish. Scottish people are all Irish anyway. But, uh, Conley. Good lord, he'd be thrown out of the union. Look at the Scotsman. Very. Some very tasty coffee. There. I have to say that is a jacket. Yes, my daughter gave me that. That kicks ass. That among a bunch of other things. I'm drinking me A few extra years of my life. <laughs> a few, definitely some wrinkles. There you go. That's the ticket. Okay, well, you know how it is. Uh, you know, these, uh, all these Irish songs usually a bit of a story involved in them. That's what makes them so fun. And why we keep playing them. And people keep listening. <laughs> so here's one. It's an old, old song about, you know, f having to save up enough money to buy yourself a wife. You know, the good old days. <laughs> Back when you had to put the money up front instead of after, back in. shelter for the hen and a stable for the ass now what would a man want more i don't know maybe so but a bachelor is easy and he's free still there's lots to look after though i'm living all alone sure nobody's looking after me father comes to tell me I should go and have a try To find a girl that owns a bit of land And I know the way he says it There's someone on his mind My mother's got the whole thing planned I don't know, or maybe so But a pat there with a hack and with degrees Now there's little Bridget Flynn Sure it's her I'd love to win But she doesn't have an eye for me She doesn't have an eye on me Oh, oh, 
Just as soon as I get bold She come and have an eye for me How will she go? I don't know But I'd love to have her sitting on my knee, you know And it sing like a thrush in a hawthorn bush She come and have an eye for me She come and have an eye Try a little, uh, let's turn it up a little bit. What do you think? How about, let's get a little volume. I've never actually played this one, so give me a, give me a little bit of a, thank you. Can you hear that all right? This, this jacket does not help, it's slick. It's falling off, I need a string. There you go. I just totally feel like like Spinal Tap. <laughs> oh hell, it's a ukulele. Who gives a fuck? All right. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Oh, oh pardon me, pardon me, Miss Ukulele Lady. <laughs> ukulele. All right, let's give this a whirl and see what happens. Okay, so, uh, you know, they, this song sort of embodies, uh, uh, embodies the, uh, well, the immigrant story, but in, in the Irish sort of vein, uh, but it's sort of a, it's the every, every, everybody's immigrant story, which I'm sure most of you are immigrants of some manner of a... Um, so uh, just a, a translation to, to start off with, a prati is a potato. Okay, here we go. Ugh, that's in the way. Come on, mate. Go over there. How's that? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Enough of your yapping. Go on, yet. Goodbye, Mrs. Durkin. I'm sick and tired of working. No more I'll dig your praties. No longer I'll be poor. Cause sure as my name is Barney, I'll be off to California. 
Instead of digging praties, I'll be digging lumps of gold. Ha! In the days that I was courting, I never tired resorting to the alehouse and the playhouse and the other house beside. But I told me brother Seamus, I'll be off now and grow famous. And the next time that you hear from me, I'll have roamed the whole world wide. So goodbye, Mrs. Durkin, I'm sick and tired of working. No more I'll dig your praise, no longer I'll be poor Cause sure as my name is Barney, I'll be off to California Instead of digging praise, I'll be digging lumps of gold <laughs> Well I courted girls in Barney and Anstrom and Killarney From Dublin up to Derry, down to the Cobb of Cork But I off to take my leisure, cause I'm done with all this pleasure And the next time that you hear from me, I'll write you from New York So, I'll go by since 13, I'm sick and tired of work And I'm more I'll dig your pretties, no longer I'll be poor So sure as my name is Barney, I'll be off to California Instead of digging pretties, I'll be digging lumps of gold Woo -hoo. When I landed in America, I met a man named Burke he said if I should stay a while, he'd surely find me work. But work he didn't find me, so there's nothing here to bind me. I'm bound for San Francisco and California. Hey, hey. And then, Mr. Ken, I'm sick and tired of working. No more I'll dig your pretties, no longer I'll be poor. Cause sure as my name is Barney, I'll be off to California. Instead of digging pretties, I'll be digging lumps of gold. All right. <laughs> Enough of that. Bit. Put it back in its little magical sack. Oh, it's quite magical, by the way. It's got grasshoppers on it and dragonflies and fireflies and strange looking guys. It is green. Some might say an avocado. But it is green. And if, you're, and if you're not dressed in green, that's plenty fine. As long as you're green with envy, no one will hold it against you. Okay. Now, I bear no ill will to whatever side you happen to be on, whether it's the, uh, the Catholic green side or the orange Protestant side, makes no difference to me. It's all a bunch of silliness as well. But nonetheless, it inspired some great music. <laughs> so, I have a bit of this problem in my family. Uh, so, not quite autobiographical. This is an Irish Rover song, but for uh, a couple of kids from Canada whose parents are from Northern Ireland, I figure safe enough. Here we go. <laughs> so, uh, if you're familiar with the Irish flag, which I'm so sorry I forgot to bring my flags. I normally have uh, the Irish flag. If you don't remember, is an orange a white and a green. And the green obviously represents the Catholics and the orange represents the Protestants and the white is supposed to be the peace between them, but you know, it, it better, it's better if it was red. Yeah, it is a good flag, good intentions. Okay, so this is a song about the orange and the green. Oh, this is the biggest mix up that you have ever seen. My father, he was orange, and my mother, she was green. Well, my father was an Ulster man, proud Protestant was he. My mother was a Catholic girl from County Cork was she. They were married in two churches, lived happily enough. Until the day that I was born and things got rather tough ah, This is the biggest mix-up that you have ever seen My father, he was orange and me mother, she was blue 
Guys, my father Riley, I was rushed away by car To be made a little orangeman, my father's shining star But though Chris and David Anthony, still in spite of that To me father, I was William, while me mother called me Pat Ah, this is the biggest mix-up that you have ever seen Me father, he was orange, and me mother, she was Oh, that's fine, I was okay, take a cookie though <laughs> I lost my mind now. Oh, where'd it go? I was somewhere. I was stepping on it somewhere. One night, my ma's relations stopped by to visit me. Just as my father's kinfolk were all sitting down to tea Oh no, tried to smooth things over but they all began to fight And me had been strictly neutral, I bashed everyone in sight And I said the biggest big soap that you have ever seen My father is orange and my mother she was Well me parents never could agree about me type of school Me learning was all done at home, that's why I'm such a fool they both passed on, God rest them, but they left me caught between The awful colour from the mouth, the orange and the green hey, This is the biggest mix-up that you have ever seen My father, he was orange, and me mother, she was green ah, This is the biggest mix-up that you have ever seen My father, he was orange Those are those wild, appagiated riffs that Matt's so good at. <laughs> oh, thank heaven for <sighs> coffee. <sighs> yes. That is a good cup of joe. Just so you know. Although I think, I think I might uh, I think I might have a little pal that might want to come up here and... Hey Paula, you want to play a song? Oh, she's just in the middle of a conversation. You good? Do you want to play? Alright, well, well I might take a break for a little bit. and We're going to get Paula Montando up here to play some uh, ukulele. Two, three. Okay. Cool. Um, you want me to play the K-Home? Okay, so uh, Paul is gonna come up here and play a couple of chins, as they would say. Chins. Like a chin of fish. Is that a chum of fish? Oh wow, look at that. I got tips already, wow. That is not a, a, a plea for tips, trust me. This is a, but thank you very much, that was very kind of you, thank you. He got tips in cookies. Sweet. Okay, there's beer money. Or, I'm sorry, coffee money. Forgot. Okay, give us a second. We'll get Paul all tuned up. Oh, heavens no. No, oh, come on, kids. It's okay. Thank you. And uh, just if, in case anybody was interested, we're going to have a raffle. Cha, cha. What's all that business? What's echoing? Oh, it's that thing. What is that? Oh, it's that thing. Okay. Uh, 
Yes, yeah, we're gonna have a raffle. So if you want a ticket for a raffle, it's gonna raffle off a. Music box hat, right there. Two dollars a ticket. Come and see me. I was gonna bring my um, like my big heavy metal guitar and do like a slash heavy metal set, but um, I opted for the ukulele. <laughs> I don't know any Irish songs. I just have semi-original songs. And Billy's going Billy be gonna play. Yay, Billy! Thank you for putting on this. Woohoo! We're glad. We missed him, right? We missed the music box. We missed the music box. <laughs> Okay, I think this is kind of a reggae song, ish. <laughs> sort of reggae, anyway. Hello. Right? Yeah, reggae on the ukulele on during the day of Irish list. <laughs>
dancing in the Birmingham jail. He's dancing in the Birmingham jail. He took a hundred dollars off a slider house job. Brand new Michigan 20 gear. You can tell me later. Black <laughs> <laughs> sky jumping like a jukebox jockey. Dragging around the metal like a violin in hell. Break me a pie with your roach kill, baby. Kiss me in the sun. Last night's whiskey.
heavy metal set. It's just okay. that's it. All right. We're bringing out. We're bringing out the Telecaster next time. That's Paula Montando, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Wicked cool. She's so good. So good. Rocks it out with the ukulele. Hello. I love my Paula. Oh, I'm going to have to jump well, down. I'm going to pick one from the tree. Oh. <laughs> one second. We are officially rocking. Okay. I had to do a little equipment change there for a second. fashion guy okay well this is looks really interesting it's like cough syrup right okay so that's inspiring me to play this next song for y'all this is an excellent song it really it really kicks the teeth in, you know what I mean? And it gives you a little bit of inspiration in life. Oh. This is a great guitar, isn't it? Oh, kids, fantastic. It is. The other one is lovely too, but it's a bit dull for a night like this. It's a little bit, doesn't handle the, the elements quite as well. This one does. Medicinal purposes only. <laughs> For my rheumatiz. <laughs> well, that's a fucking chaser, though. I'll say, I'll say. Tight. Well, it's, it's inspired this next song. Look at that, huh? It's been in a bag for two months and it's in tune. Pretty good. Not like it would really matter right about now then. I am a young fellow as fond of me fun. And fair London Derry is where I begun. All over the country I spent all my cash with Kitty and Jenny and uh, Mary McNash. <clears throat> my father disowned me for being such a wreck, always spending my time such frolicsome ways. The girls they are sweet, but I'll have you all known. That me first love in life is the pure whiskey. Transport to go to the town of Kildare All the women around me, they flock on the square Some bring me a bottle, and some bring me cake ah! And they do it behind their old dear parson's back 
There's one from Mocker and one from Carlisle And another one from Daddy, the heart has beguiled But it trade every one for a drop of the pure Cause me first love is whiskey Ah, the hard thing to cure For the riches I never incline For the wealthiest miser must leave it behind With a glass in my hand and a girl on my knee Is all my need for his pleasure, you see A right knew a man who had plenty of gold And I knew another who had twenty times more But they're both on their backs among nettles and stone my first of his whiskey, the whiskey lord. Really, 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 As for the future, I mean to be wise. And I look for the women who've treated me kind. And I'll marry them all on the next market day. If the clergy agrees to the things that I say. And when the end and my soul is at rest, these women will come forth to cry in me wake And they'll cover me over with whiskey so pure And they'll dance on the lid of my coffin And the There he goes, pulling a seventh chord up. <laughs> oh, heavens to Murgatroyd. Anybody know where Murgatroyd is, by the way? Anybody? Murgatroyd? Where is it, anyway? Anybody know? No? Is it like right almost at Purgatory, but it's not quite? It's like a midway to Purgatory or Murgatroyd? Okay, well, I guess I just solved my own problem, my own riddle. Okay, okay here's a song, uh, a sweet song. This is an old song. It took, it took 280 some odd years to write this song. Oh well. I was playing a party at, uh, in Orange County with the music box and <clears throat> some very wealthy young man stuck a bottle, a big bottle of Blue Label uh, whiskey on, the, on the, the stage. He just sat it there. 
was like, oh, nice one. That's good. That's like a $200 bottle of whiskey. Of course, I'm stomping around, and it knocks over. It left the cap on. Fucking thing. Pour it out. <laughs> you saw, I saw three grown adults, a woman and two men, licking the floor of this thing. That's pretty disgusting. One of them was me. But that's okay, because I've been tested with tetanus and whatnot. <laughs> All right. After this song, we're going to do the raffle, I think. So if anybody else wants to buy a raffle ticket, two bucks, come on up. We're raffling off a music box hat. Two bucks. I'll even front you. Oh, you're right, yeah. Okay, fine. Okay, so I'm going to play this sweet song. Uh, it's a very sweet song. It's a love song, you know. A sort of unrequited love, though, actually, to be honest. Or lost, love lost. I think I have to do this in a higher key. Well, whatever, don't matter. See, if Mark, you want to play a song afterwards? Okay, I'll play one more. And then we'll have Mark come up here and play a couple of songs. And then we'll do the raffle, okay? Here we go. <laughs> I've got a channel. The time traveling. You're gonna pierce back through time. Back to 1763. 1763. Yes. Oh, oh, my love is like a red, red rose. It's newly sprung in June. My love is like a melody, sweetly played in gin. Oh, so fair art thou, my bonny wee lass. And so deep in love am I. Oh, and I will love thee still. All the sea is gang dry. Scottish uh, Shakespeare and we celebrate his death day as well as today. Do you know that St. Patrick's Day is actually the day he died, not the day he was born, just so you know. So good on him. <laughs> Snakes my ass. I've got one right here. 
Try and right. fucking knock that one out, huh? Oh, okay, good. Marky. He's got one point. Here we go. Oh, you got your own. Okay, you got your guitar. Here we go. We're gonna get Mark Stegel up here to play a couple songs for you. Yeah. Yeah, that was great, Billy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't know, that's Billy Stoba, who's the host here in the music box. Fantastic human being. Fantastic! Right? Always hosts these events. Yeah. 